welcome back to school. So you know what? On the first day of school in my family, this is kind of nerdy, but it's like one of the ways that we get excited about school. My mom, she calls me in the morning and this is what she does. She goes, school days, school days, good old golden rule days, reading and writing and arithmetic all to the tune of the hickory stick. And we're like, but it's happened for so many years that now I like expect it and I love it. It's like, part of my back to school routine. I bet you didn't know that. I literally sing it on a video for my family every year when I start school on the first day. Like I have like a series of videos for 14 years of this. Okay, but I think we have to get really excited about coming to school in 2021, right? We had Christmas break, it was awesome. We got to rest and relax and now it's time to get back to school. And I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, oh my gosh. How can I be excited about this? Literally, I'm going back to the online platform. I'm not even gonna see my friends. Like, it's the same old jazz. I don't wanna get out of bed. I don't wanna put on my clothes. I don't wanna go to Zoom sessions. I don't wanna do online homework. Okay, wait, let's stop. Cause you know what? We have a choice. We have a choice. Every day of our lives, we have a choice. We can choose to look at the day and focus on the negatives. And you guys know what I mean. You guys know what I mean. Because we all do it, we all do it, where we look at the day and we can pick. Am I gonna look at today as a blessing and be glad that I have the opportunity to go to school? Am I gonna be glad that I have employment today? Am I going to be glad that I have these relationships in my life, these people around me? Or am I not? Am I gonna sit here and be upset? And I'm not looking down on you. I'm not saying that as a person, you're not a good person because you struggle. Because you know what? We all struggle. We all have days where sometimes we are able to more easily focus on the positive and other days we're not. And I get that, I get that but I wanna challenge you and I wanna challenge me and I wanna challenge those around me. Let's try, let's try. Let's try to see that glass as half full instead of half empty. Let's focus on the blessings we have and the good things. And let's challenge ourselves. Let's push ourselves to ask and demand more out of ourselves, right? Because I can let myself just exist that's a possibility. There's plenty of opportunity for that, especially in the online platform, right? I can sleep in. I can go to Zoom meetings in my pajamas and keep my camera off. It's not just students that can do that. I could do that because I'm at home, working from home all day. It's up to me to determine the level of ownership that I'm gonna take over my choices, over my job each day. So let's determine together that we will challenge ourselves to excellence, that we will push ourselves beyond our frustration, beyond our exhaustion, beyond our feelings of sadness or loneliness, that we will challenge and push ourselves to believe that there is hope because there is, there is always hope. And as human beings, it's one of the beautiful things about being a human being, we have the opportunity to decide within our own minds that we are going to overcome, that we are going to take the challenges surrounding us and we are going to push forward. This dude, Arthur Williams Jr., he said, I am not telling you it is going to be easy. I am telling you, it is going to be worth it. Take that with you. In life, not just today, but always. I'm not telling you it's gonna be easy. It's never going to be easy. Today, right now, this is not the last challenge that we will face. But I promise you, the act of living, the act of enduring, the act of overcoming, is going to be worth it. And I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you every day. I recognize what you're going through to persevere. I see you. I appreciate your efforts. 
and I'm right here with you. And I always will be cheering for you because I believe in you and you can do this.